Let, let's just start right from the very basic beginning. The, the first indicator or something that people need to be concerned about that would tell them that this is a potential road to a nephrologist. Again, usually it does begin in the primary care physician's office. Often people don't have symptoms, they don't have anything that will throw a flag at them and say, oh, I need to see, go see a kidney doctor on my own. However, there are symptoms that people do find. They may get swelling, they may have a sudden elevation in their blood pressure, they may have blood in their urine, they may notice that their urine is changing, it may become very foamy, very bubbly, um, but often there's some by our primary care physicians. Yeah, and I, th I think it's important to note that, you know, we're talking about blood in the urine, but sometimes there's not actually anything you can see. Uh, we classify blood in the urine as hematuria, but a lot of times you can't see it. So a lot of times people don't have symptoms, which is, is the big problem. And we were seeing on that package, these people are healthy. They're young 25-year-old people. This is an athlete. These are people who otherwise you wouldn't guess have kidney disease. Well, you mentioned hematuria, then if they can't see it, and, and if people want to at least be aware of what may be a problem, what then should they be looking for, uh, specifically at home? I, there, if you can't see it, you won't find it, right? Which is important, again, right. stressing the importance of seeing a primary care doctor. The, the role of preventative medicine, if you feel fine, you still need to go to your primary care. You still need to get your blood pressure checked. You need to get your blood test done. You need to get your urine test done. Because by the time, or if you wait too long until you actually have symptoms, you may already be very advanced. I think the positive thing, too, is that these tests are not very invasive. You know, in medicine, we talk about with preventative medicine, getting a colonoscopy, doing things that actually require procedure. It can be as simple as just urinating in a cup, and then we can tell a lot of things, right? We can tell if there's blood in the urine, if there's protein, and that's, that's great news. I think that these tests are easy and they're actually simple and cheap uh, for the insurance companies to do, and your insurance company will pay for it.